What's up YouTube and welcome back to the safe zone. My name is Cole or the master reactor and today we are unfortunately not reacting to anything. Basically today I am just wanting to inform you of a huge huge update in my life and this is going to be a bit more of a serious video so if you're looking for like the happy-go-lucky reactions please make sure to go check those out on my channel but I I heavily ask that you stay and listen to what I have to say. So recently I have been doing a lot of soul searching and self um, reassuring out. I don't know the word for it, but basically I've been taking a deep dive into who I am. It's like I took that week long break and then also you see that I didn't upload yesterday or technically today because I didn't give a reaction. But the thing about that is, is because I have been deep in trying to figure out myself. <laughs> Um, and this is honestly a really happy occasion because I finally come to the terms with the fact that I know who I am now. For the longest time, I've grown up with parents who are completely conservative. They are against, uh, like, people assigning genders, pronouns, um, basically anything that, oh, they're very, very strict Christians. And I'm not throwing any shade at Christianity. If you want to be a Christian, that is totally fine. I am not at all going to hate on you for that. Honestly, you being a Christian is your choice and you can be, you can do that if you would like. However, my experience with my parents being so condescending and judging of me as a person, and they don't even know it, but, um, it's just been a difficult journey for me. And so figuring all this out on my own has been really hard, but it's really helped that my friends are also very supportive. Like I say on my own, but that's because I ha I don't have any family to go to about this, but my friends have been there for me in places where my, my family hasn't. And it, they have really, really helped me. But the main thing is I'll just put it out there. Um, for the past year and a half, two years, I have been identifying as non-binary. Now, that's because I was trying to find an answer for who I was. And I still think that, like, I, I still understand why I thought that. But the more I looked into it and the more I, like, kept living, the more I realized that the things that I had been feeling, the way about myself that I had been feeling for my entire life has been because of one thing and one thing only. And that is, I'm not non-binary i'm trans now i'm i'm very nervous bringing this to the attention of youtube because i know there are tons of people out there who have such a negative view about trans trans people like me um and so it, it's been crazy because i've been very worried about posting this video like i have sat down to record this multiple times but I have never actually recorded it. Now, I know that I'm not elegantly wording this. I am honestly very bad with words when it comes to, like, just talking. But I, I wanted you as, like, my fan, like, my fan base, people who are subscribed to me, I want you to know who I truly am. And I thought that I just need to get this video done. If you are watching this and you are a bit confused on what being trans means, and what it all entails, I would highly suggest you go check out Jamie Dodger's channel. He is an amazing, amazing YouTube channel who has helped me a lot with understanding who I am and really like discovering myself in that way. So his channel will be linked in the description down below because you honestly should check him out if you haven't already. However, I don't want to say this like I'm leaving non-binary behind. I appreciate my time as identifying as non-binary because i understood i i now understand where my my brain was because think about it i was growing from 16 years of brainwashed christianity where i was really taught to be homophobic i was taught to be like all these bad things because of the way that my parents raised me in this religion and coming out of that it's like i was completely like I, it was like I was a baby again, where I was just learning about the world for the first time. And 
doing research on this and discovering more and more about myself that I that makes so much sense now like for my entire life I've hated my voice my body my like I've hated everything about myself but I've never understood why I always thought it was something wrong with me or something that I just genuinely didn't have any control over but as I've done research and as I've truly like looked at my life I've realized that I that who I am is trans I am trans and so I just wanted to put this out here because I want you all as my fan base to know who I am now again as I've said I'm not highly educated on like explaining this topic like from what I from what I've researched and what I've seen in myself I, I know for a fact that I am trans and I am very bad at putting my thoughts into words. I struggle with that a lot, but I, I highly suggest that if you do have any questions for me that you leave a comment down below so I can try and answer them the best I can. I'm much better typing than I am speaking off the cuff. I probably should have made a script for this video, but I just want it to be as genuine as possible. <laughs> Making this video is just helping me so much because I'm actually saying it. I like part there are parts of my brain that from my condition to childhood who say that I'm still an awful awful person for even thinking this but I know for a fact that I'm not this is, it's not just something I think it's who I am and this being who I am and who I've always been and who I will be is the most reassuring thought that I could have ever like discovered <laughs> I keep watching this back and I'm I feel like I'm not making any sense, but I hope that you are understanding where I'm coming from with this because I know that I am very bad with words. Um, and I know that I say things sometimes that that like are a bit weird because I, I can't I can't just speak like this. But I just I wanted you to know who I am. Uh I haven't been to counseling about this yet. I have not taken any steps towards transitioning yet but that's because of the current situation I'm in with my parents and my family and my school and my future like right now it's all very very against me and who I am and so many people in this world are and it's so like upsetting it seems like every day I see another story or another article about people openly being transphobic and it hurts me so much there are people in the uk who are trying to revoke trans rights from the like equality act which is just insane to think about and it just hurts so much to hear but those people unfortunately do exist now if any of you decide to stop supporting me because of who i am you are totally free to do that while i don't think you should and i honestly think that it would be great if you stuck around. If you honestly believe that you can't associate with my channel anymore, I will totally understand. I Going into this and truly realizing myself as who I have always been and who I am, I, I know that there will be people out there who don't agree with me and who don't accept me for who I am. That's one thing that I am struggling with a ton right now is just the fear of of the world really and it's strong it's really strong so i hope that all of you can accept me for who i am and if you can't i kindly ask that you don't leave angry comments on all my videos about it so i highly suggest that you go support uh, Jamie Dodger his channel is amazing and very informational and also very funny um I've talked about him a bit in this video but his channel goes so in depth into like he he Jamie Dodger has a doctorate in this kind of stuff he knows what he's talking about so I highly suggest you go check out his channel it will be linked in the description down below but he has been a huge a huge help in doing research on what being trans is being a sheltered christian boy according to my parents for my entire life has put me in such a compromised position of 
hate like hatred for myself it's called gender dysphoria and i'm sure most of you like know this stuff but i'm just saying it so i i am understanding it myself and i have been struggling with gender dysphoria for my entire life and so finally realizing why that one what i am suffering from is gender dysphoria and two understanding that it is it, it's because of me not being a man um and it's been so eye opening and so amazing and like just me saying <laughs> just me accepting myself for who i really am is amazing now i would like to start transitioning as fast as possible but with my current like scenario and with how how i am currently living which is with my parents who are openly transphobic it's very hard so i ask that you all share your support by liking and subscribing and leaving a nice comment or question but i won't make you do any of that obviously but i hope that you all accept me for me and i will see you all in the next reaction goodbye